Hi guys, my name is Pema Tonsela and welcome to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I want to show you how to determine the standard deviation of ungrouped data using a calculator. When you get to grade 11 and 12, um, when you look at the number of marks allocated to standard deviation, it's quite small for you to go through um, determining that using the manual way. So it's it's convenient that you use this method and also sometimes the data set is quite big for you to perform the manual route so it's always convenient for you to be using the calculator format so here you are given a data set so step one you will select mode you will get a list of options what you also need to remember is that calculators layout is different. So you need to follow the description and not necessarily the numbering of the options. So we are looking for stats, which is on number three. We are looking for variance, which is on number one. Then we can start inputting our entry. So we have five after each, we press an equal sign. So it's five equal. Then it's eight equal. Then it's 15 equal, 20 equal, 25 equal, 27 equal, 30 equal, 31 equal, 36 equal, and 75. When you're done, you press AC and then you are looking for the secondary option of one. So you will say shift stats. We are looking for variance, which is four. So this will give you an option to determine what is the number of terms in your data set, what is your mean and what is your standard deviation. We don't necessarily use option four. So let's say you want to know what is the number of items or for you to double check that you entered the entries correctly. You will do that. You will, get an e you will press an equal sign. You will get 10. You can also verify that by counting. Then to get your standard, your mean, you will say shift, stats, variance, two, equal, and get 27.2. Then to get your standard deviation, you will say shift one, four, three, equal sign and get 18.57. To get the variance, you will take that number of your standard deviation and square it. That brings us to the end of our session. Until next time, toodles.